Hi guys, so today's video is a little bit different. Uh, this video, I basically, I'm trying to make a decision internally and I decide why not share it. So pretty much uh, the other night I was hanging out and someone within the first minute of meeting me, uh, we started speaking about business and stuff like that. And then, she, you know, I expressed to her that I don't know if I'm going to continue staying in Bahrain or if I'm going to head back to the U.S. And she said to me, if there's one thing that you would do and you do it anywhere in the world, what would you do? And without hesitation, I said to her, speak. She says, I'm not surprised. And I smiled and, you know, I said, why did you say that? She said, because I, I could hear it within you. So for many years, I've always thought about speaking. And hear me out, that's what I've been doing. But I've not gone full force into it or being consistent because I always look at what is bringing in the income, what will pay the bills. Yeah, because we all have bills. So, you know uploading videos on YouTube and, you know, just doing certain activities consistently. Consistently is the key word, being persistent. Um, what you need to do to really push myself out there for people to know who I am and my gift. So, yes, I do training, corporate training, and all that great stuff, but I love to speak. So she said, can you do this in Bahrain or can you do this in the States? Although Bahrain is a lovely country, the population is extremely small. So I still need to go through my head to see, you know, should I stay or should I go? Because at the same time, I mean, I can still be in the States and move around quite frequently and go wherever I choose to go. But I'm sharing this information with you because sometimes within ourselves, we go through the what should I do? We go through it when we reach 20, we reach 30, we reach 40, we reach 50, 60, 70, and so forth. Now, of course, 70 is usually, you know, you retire, 60, you retire, whatever. Some people think like that, not everyone. But some people reach a part in their life, it's like, okay, I've done this. I did this before. You know, am I walking in my purpose? Am I walking in my true calling? Some people say there's no such thing. Some people say, follow your talent. But I believe in following happiness. Because without happiness, you know, you're truly not waking up to smile. So what is it that makes me smile? What is it that makes me happy? Speaking. It's as simple. Just speaking, I have a lot of stories, a lot of different information, a lot of things I could share with you, more than just business tips, you know, from personal things that happened in my life and how I overcame, or back on the business side, you know, how I'm able to sustain myself being an entrepreneur or being a professor, some things that I've experienced. But just speaking, that's what I love to do. So if you're someone that's just wondering or you just gave up on something that you love to do and, you know, just following the paycheck, if that doesn't truly make you happy, look inside yourself and say or think, what makes me happy? What makes me wake up? what makes me put on my clothes and get going and do it. All right, guys, until next time.